Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Elizabeth. Now in today's video, I'm doing another product review. Now the product I'm going to be reviewing is by Diva Curl, and it's the Super Cream Coconut Curl Styler. It's this little product right here. Now this product isn't new in the market at all, and I recently, not recently, I tried this product out like two years ago. I decided to film an actual product review on it, you know, to give you guys a review, and I wanted to buy it again. Now this is a little product clearly because it's three fluid ounces. Um, the regular size product is, um, let me see how many ounces... It's five ounces. Wow. That is not a difference. What the heck? So this is three ounces and the big size one is five fluid ounces. Interesting. So this product retails for $12 and I bought it at Ulta. Now let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. When I went to Ulta, this doesn't have the price there. As you guys can see in this clip, see everything is $10. Uh, one product is $14. But this super cream isn't listed there. I, I assume $10. I assume the best. When I went to the cash register, the lady was like, oh, $12. And I was like, what? What? Where did that come from? But, you know, I was already at the register, so I bought it. So the reason why I didn't buy the full-size product is, one, because it's $28. And, two, it's because I have so many products already that I can't keep buying hair products. Like, I can't. I bought this because I don't feel bad because it's little and I'm able to use it up quickly. But if I have, a, like, a big-size hair product, it's going to take me a while to use it up. So I feel guilty. When I first purchased it, I really did like it. I didn't repurchase it just because um, I was trying so many new products out. But I'm curious to see if I still like this. So this review is for you and this review is for me. So let's get started with what this product claimed that it does. Whether you want to soften, define, tame, frizz, twist out, or switch up your look, this rich coconut oil and fuse styler does it all. With super cream, less is more. You can use on wet, damp, or dry hair to create different looks. Rub the product between your palms and smooth over curls for thorough coverage. And then on the website it says, is it for me? Now it says, do you have curly or super curly hair that craves silky moisture definition curl control? Then, oh yeah. So that's what I'm really going to base this product on. If it gives me like um, good curl definition, if it's hydrating, good curl control. So we're going to see all that. But let's get to the point and open this baby up. Okay. Right off the bat, it's creamy. I love me some creamy hair products so much. Look at that. It has that coconut scent, of course. It smells a little like sunblock. It doesn't smell bad, but I like it. I like the way coconut smells. So, yeah. It smells like coconut. I look like a mine. Let's do this. Ooh, it's really white. My hair is drying up. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is all that I'm going to apply to my hair right now. I really like that this product is nice and creamy. It glided nicely throughout my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and let it air dry, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. So this is how day one hair is currently looking. I'm sorry that the lighting is a little bit off, and that's just because I'm using natural light, and it's about to rain. What's new in Florida? But um, this is how my hair is currently looking, and I really like the way it looks for day one hair. It looks really, really big, but at the same time defined. Like, I don't know if you guys can see all this good curl definition, but my curls are defined. It feels very, like, lightweight. It feels fluffy. Like, there's no hold at all. It feels very moisturizing. I feel like I apply a little bit too much product just because I feel it a little bit on my fingertips. It's not greasy, but I don't think my hair is completely dried because I can feel it on my fingertips. This product does stay with super cream less is more and I applied a lot. I applied a lot, so I should have paid more attention to that. But this is just how my hair is currently looking for day one. I like that it feels super soft. It feels moisturized. It looks really good. It feels big. feels fluffy. And the curl definition is real with this. It looks really good for first day hair. I'm going to check back with you guys tomorrow for day two. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Let's take a good look on how day two hair is looking. And I think it looks pretty good for day two. Like, I think it looks pretty good. So what I'm liking so far is that my curls are still defined. As you guys can see... It's really defined. It looks bigger than it was yesterday. So that's another pro of this product. And that's what I noticed with most Diva Curl products. Like on day one, it looks good. And then on day two, it looks really big and fluffy. So I'm really liking that for today. And you know what I noticed? Let me get comfortable when I say this. This product's three fluid ounces and $12. Okay? The big product is five fluid ounces and $28. So if you buy two of these mini size ones, you're going to get six fluid ounces for around $24, $25. Which is still cheaper than buying the big size, which is $28. Isn't that crazy? The more you know, the more you know. But anyways, this is pretty much all I have to say for day two hair. I'm going to check back with you guys for day three. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey guys, so today's going to be the third and final day of me reviewing the style cream right here. 
so I can give you guys my pros and my cons right now. So let's start off with how my hair is currently looking. And as you guys can see, my hair is looking pretty freaking big. Like, I told you guys, with Diva Curl hair products, it gets bigger the more days you use it. And it's way bigger than day two hair. I do like that it didn't weigh down my curls. And I was kind of surprised because this product is nice and creamy. So you don't have to worry about it weighing down your hair because it just makes your hair look better the more days it goes. So another pro of this product would be how hydrating it is. So since the texture is nice and creamy, it left my hair feeling nice and moisturized. Like my curls do not feel dry whatsoever. So I'm not afraid to use this product by itself just because I know that my hair is not going to feel dry. And it's, it's just going to feel nice and soft. So another pro of this product would be the scent. Now I like coconut hair products. I do like the way they smell. Now with this product, it has like a coconut sunblock scent. Which I don't think smells bad. I do like the way it smells. It does linger in the hair. So if you guys are not a fan of coconut. And if you don't like any like strong fragrant products. I would stay away from this just because you are going to smell it. Yeah, so these are just some of the pros that I'm finding with this hair product. I really do like the way it looks. So when I did that video about the no product hair challenge. In that video, my hair was pretty freaking big of course. But um, I was looking for a product to provide that volume but with curl definition and I feel like I found it with this product just because my curls are looking pretty big but some sections are still defined. It's not as crazy as when my hair didn't have any hair products. So I feel like this product is really good. <laughs> but let's talk about some of the cons before I keep talking about how much I like this product. So I feel like a con of this product, which I feel like I'm pushing it, is the curl definition. Even though the sides are pretty undefined, I feel like overall, if you're looking at the bigger picture, um, my hair still looks pretty good. Now me, I love me some good curl definition, but for day three hair, I'm really loving the volume and I'm still liking that my curls are still defined. Even though some sections are a little bit undefined, I can look past that just because um, it looks frizzy in a good way. Does that make sense? Like my hair doesn't look crazy at all. Like I'm really liking how day three hair looks. And I just really like this volume. Like you guys can see that my hair looks pretty good for day three hair. So that's all I have to say about this hair product. I really like how my hair turned out using this for three days. Um, if you guys have tried this product out, let me know what you think. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Leave it down below. I would love to know your guys' opinion on it. If you guys have any other products you would like to see me review next, leave it down as well. That way I can make a list and try to review those products for 2018. If you guys found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.